Okay, so what is reamping? Reamping is when we take a signal from our playlist, like a MIDI file or a track, run it through a headphone jack, out of the headphone jack, and into a piece of outboard equipment like this Electro Harmonics Lester G pedal, run it out of the Lester G, back into the audio interface, and record it in the playlist all at the same time, like this. Here we go. I'm going to be using a very basic FL Studio preset from Citrus called Four Draw Bars for a very basic church organ sound for a MIDI file. Here's what that sounds like. Yeah, so what we want to do is we want to send that signal through this, the Lester G pedal, and back into our audio interface and record it. Here's how we do that. Okay, so here's the trick. Go into Options, Audio Settings, and make sure that FL Studio ASIO is selected. Then go down here to the Details and click on here and make sure that not focus right, but your headphone output from Windows is selected. In my case it's Realtek. So what that means is that we can take some arbitrary piece of cabling like this right here, take it out of the PC headphone jack, into the Lester G, out of the Lester G, and into the audio interface and record it that way. Let's do that. Now I haven't tried going right out of the audio interface headphone into the pedal and back into the audio interface because I believe it would create some kind of an unstoppable and uncontrollable feedback loop that would probably harm your relatives and pets and goldfish. Okay, back to the desktop. Let's come down here to track five. Select track mode, audio track, insert five on the mixer. Let's rename this mixer track real quick. Lester G. Okay, so now whenever we arm the track for recording, we get feedback. So what we have to do is disconnect it from the master like this. And it stops the feedback loop. Right click the recording button, make sure that audio only is selected. Yes into the playlist and we get a count off. Okay, so there's our new reamped recording. Okay, let's route it back to the master. Deselect the arm button and the input. Let's go back into our audio options and return our output to focus right so we can hear our recording through our headphones and see what it sounds like.
So what does it sound like in the mix? That's about it. Hope you enjoyed it. There's a lot you can do with this information, like send your boo bass track through one of these uh, Tech 21 YYZ pedals, but you got to be careful because it might cause like a black hole to form outside the solar system. So be careful what you do with this information. <laughs> Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.